Hey, how's it going guys? Marsh Games here and welcome back to Grounded. This is episode 3 of my survival and today I'm going to be building or at least starting to build my epic base. And so I'm going to choose this location here. I'm next to one of the juice boxes, Lemon Crime. <laughs> It's, uh, yeah, it's Lemon Crime Upon. So I'm going to build it right here. And I'm doing that because there is juice right here. I'm going to have a tunnel that's going to go from the main base, which is in this little open area right here. A little grass that goes all the way here. And then a giant platform with a bunch of water catchers so we can have plenty of drinks to have. And then this is where the foundation is going to be right here. And I'm planning to have foundation of clay and then another layer of foundation wall around it to almost make it seem like a basement. Kind of like... <laughs> kind of like a cobblestone base in Minecraft, but as you can see, I have a ton of supplies. You have a bunch of spider chunks. That's gross. Looks really gross. But also flower petals because I was making a video and a bunch of clay. I went and got a bunch of clay, and this is quartzite. Quartzite is used to repair items. What? Oh. Oh no. <laughs> if I press I, go to my inventory and click on any item, and I can. Click our repair and quartzite will repair it. And why is that popping up over it? Oh well, I don't care. I also got ant armor as you can see. I've had those for a few videos now, but ant armor allows you to carry up to eight things in your hauling. Right there as you can see. And that's just because the um the largest thing that you need is a palisade or a palisade? What is it called again? I don't I forget, but I need it I need five thousand raw science here. And I have to buy that upgrade from Burgle in the lab right over, wait, right over here? Yeah, right over here. All right, so we're going to get started with this build. We're going to start with some clay foundations, and we're going to put them here. Yeah, we're going to put them, let's start like right, oh, I thought it was a spider. <laughs> start there, two, three, four, and we'll go two, three, four, five over. Ooh, that's not even going to be high enough, though, for a... Recycle, how much we get back? Oh, I only get two back. That's sad. Okay, I fixed it to how I want it. I just went and loaded up my other save. All right, so here's a deal. This is the only one that fits here, and it's kind of annoying because I want to put more here, but it's just not working. <laughs> As you can see, it's just not working. Oh, one works there, but that looks stupid. I want to put one side to side, but... Uh, oh, well. Maybe we can put... Uh, let's see... Let's go plank pallet. Oh, come on. You're joking. <laughs> See, like, it works there, but that's, like, dumb looking. It's on a slope. Well, let's try the stem pallet. Of course, that'll work there. I mean, that actually could work. Yeah, that'll work. All right, so I had almost exactly enough um, what's this, clay here to build up this foundation, so I'm going to leave it like this. Looks pretty cool. We're going to have our storage down here of planks and stems. And I got a stair here, and I want to put floors, where the floors are here, like right here, yeah, that'll look good, and then we can have a first level right here, I don't know what we're going to put here, but it's going to be cool, I want to also put a staircase right here into a tunnel, and the tunnel will go to the, uh, the juice box over here, and will one be enough? I think so, eh, yeah, we'll be good, we'll be good, four, five, six, seven, eight, there we go, and then, cool. I'm gonna like crouch down kind of, but that's okay. That's perfectly fine. Maybe we can have a storage or a workbench back there? No. I don't think we're gonna need anything back there, really. Maybe a torch? A torch would look good. Let's just put it there. I, I don't know why it's not really working perfectly, but we just need a sap, dry, uh, dry grass chunks, and sprigs. That's really easy. So we can do that well, when we're done, like detailing. I want to get the actual foundation up first. All right, I've gotten a little bit farther in the build here. I'm gonna be putting some water containers here for the drops. The drops should drop like Pretty much right here. I mean, if it doesn't, that's going to be a little weird, but we're going to put these containers. You know, I wonder if I should put them lower. I should just have two water containers on each side. It'd be kind of weird. It's sloped. I don't know if I can have it. Oh, I can't have it sloped, can I? Oh, dang. Okay, well, the drops would be like right here. And then I should probably fill in this wall so we don't lose any of these drops. There we go. That should work perfectly for now. And then we can build up these water containers. Eventually, we'll get some acorn shells, crude rope, coral leaf. I'm probably going to do the, like, utility stuff next episode of this survival. There's so many hammers. Next episode, and we're just going to get the foundations up now, as you can see. But I do have a really cool path, as you can see here. It's going to be like a tunnel. Right now, my main door is only going to be right here. Once I get the palisades, the big gates and stuff, I'm going to open up this wall here and make this the big front door. But for now, 
the, uh, the entrance and the exit is just going to be this tiny little door right here. <laughs> and our drop is already there in the morning. Hello. All right, so a little bit of a progress update. I had the tunnel done, and I put a roof on this area here. So we have the drops falling in right here, and we'll just collect them. And nothing getting there, I don't think. But I got a roof on all this. Looks kind of whack, but it's grounded. I mean, come on. It's not supposed to be like professional Minecraft modern mansion type thing. This is survival. <laughs> you know what's really funny is... I don't know why I didn't add any windows. I mean, maybe we can just have this floor as like the storage floor and the next floor can have windows. I think I'm going to do that. So I'm going to get some stairs that go up right here. I'm going to be um, oppositely parallel. Wait, that didn't really make sense, but I don't care. But we're going to put the stairs there. So up to another floor right there, just above us right here. And that floor can probably be like our home floor. We have like a smoothie station. We have a bunch of decor and stuff like that. Maybe some of this stuff, jerky, rack, do collector. Maybe a couple mushroom gardens. Actually, I have to put that in dirt, but we're going to have a smoothie station. Definitely. Probably keep some food up there. Probably have a lot of storage down here. Um, we have a basketball hoop. What? Can you really play basketball? And we have a bunch of furniture up here, too. So maybe the upstairs can be just like a living space, but we don't even use it for living because we're always surviving. <laughs> I'm stuck in a cave and I can't find my way out. That's... <gasps> oh, that was lucky. All right, first floor is done, build-wise. Um, yeah, there's just going to be a lot of stores in here, I guess, because there's no windows. It's kind of not visible to the outside at all. We're just going to maybe put maybe shelves here. I don't know how I'm going to build that, but I've seen it d be done before somewhere. That you can build little shelves, and I don't know what I'm going to do, but I'm going to figure it out. Nice, nice, nice. We can do this for literally all the corners, and then put um, two more down here. So we have eight. 16, 24, 24, that's good, or not, wait, <gasps> oh no, oh crap, stuff does despawn, remember all that stuff that was here, that was, that was a lot of good stuff, there was like venom, there was spider chunks, there was fangs, there was bombardier parts, dang it, oh and my quartzite pile is gone, oh no, <laughs> This is not fun. Okay, well, we're gonna have to get this chest built and we're gonna have to pick up all these uh, fibers everywhere. Yeah, we're gonna have to like have a place just for common resources. Like maybe have just this corner over here, like put a few walls, not a few walls, a few floors up. We can't. Oh, <gasps> we can do this? Oh. I mean, hmm. That would look nicer over here. Oh, this could take some thinking. I want to make it look really nice. There we go. We have four, seven, twelve. We have twelve of these chests. That's going to be a lot of shells. Let's see. I'm definitely going to do this off camera. All right, is that the same for the other corners? I think we can just do this for all the corners. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's go like that, and then we'll put chests below them and above them. Put maybe two or three. One. I think for. Huh? Thirsty? Oh, shut up. Just drink oh my gosh okay that's good yeah yeah i'll do the same over here we need to move upstairs though because it's been like an hour and a half and i'm not done not even close to done i only have like three hours so let's design the, th uh, the second floor here i think i'm gonna stick with just two floors for now maybe expand in the future but for now we're gonna have just two floors we can decorate this place out like crazy so let's get our grass walls next episode definitely gonna be working on the interior just gonna fill everything out and designing stuff because that's gonna take just as much time as this video is so we're gonna get windows and let's put them here hello yeah there we go windows there's nice three big windows there put some walls on the sides all right so right now I'm adding on the roof and I'm trying to think of a cool design to use for this and can I reach that? I can there we go I'm just gonna get these corner pieces first and I think I'm gonna have an open space just for sunlight just to have a little bit of variance right there so we're gonna have more uh, clover leaf roofs going up and it's gonna meet at the uh, corner up there and i can't reach right now but we're gonna figure out how to get up there maybe use scaffolding or triangle floors we can put them like every other layer and then like hop up there like this you can try that let me get some more planks mm, i think i like that it makes it more stable looking we're gonna do that we can have a nice little opening there of sunlight and we'll do the same and then I have to get all these down so we're gonna need a lot of stems so one two three four five ten we're gonna need 20 stems so that's 
That's not too bad. That's just three trips of stems. But then we're going to need, I think it's four clover leaves. Yeah, per roof. So we're going to have, what, 20? So we're going to have 80 clover leaves. <laughs> and then 80 divided by three because each clover leaf is three. Or each clover gives you three leaves. So 80 divided by three is like, what, 25, 26, 27? That's, that's not too bad. Okay, I'll be right back after I get this all done. And there it goes. Second, oh, shoot. Second last piece. I need two more planks. I got... Oh, I can recycle these. Perfect. One, two. And we place those right here. Yes! Look at that. And Okay, well, grass is growing in my house now. I thought I cut that down. Do I have to cut down the stems too? Oh, well. Well, anyways, the house is finished. I mean not finished finished but like the design for it is finished for now and it's probably not going to be the best on youtube this is not by any means supposed to be the greatest on youtube ever like I, i've seen there are multiple multiple base designs out there and eventually i'll probably put bases in other locations but it's so much fun and it's so rewarding to finally have this finished at least for now at least for this foundation so anyways hope you guys enjoyed this video i'm very excited for the future with this base up I'm going to be doing a lot of cool things next episode, next weekend actually. I'm going to be doing a resource gathering montage, getting all the things that I've placed in here ready. And then we're going to be de decorating the upstairs with a bunch of cool homey stuff like beds, smoothie machines, uh, tables, chairs. Let's see, we got, what do we got? Uh, we got head mounts, berry chairs, slime, mo uh, slime mold scones. That's really fun. And some armor dummies. So we can put some extra armor suits on... These guys, and we stick them like, I don't know, on one of these walls. But anyways, hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. These videos take a long time to make, so I'd appreciate all the support. Anyways, thank you so much for watching again, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.